You. You. Yeah. Yes, that is correct. I got full ammo on everything too. Nice. When did I get an SVD? What the fuck? I have no idea where that came from. All right, cool. That's a problem. Oh. Read the descriptions. And AK forty sevens for everybody. I want to play that game again. What's that? There's a cardboard box. This is the old box. Where's my new box? Grad, Northwest. Hello, I am back. There's a dog. And a lot of guards. Holy shit. 
And someone's sleeping up there in the distance. Dog. Okay, yeah. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Are the guards talking? I should probably change my camo up. This is probably not a good idea. Much better. Okay, so we need to get back inside. guards in the towers too huh right those have probably been catching me up previously Should be taking a nap up there soon. And I have I'm not sure if this is gonna work, but I wanna try it out. Because I remember this being a thing. I'm just going to try to rely on that high camo index. Oh, this might not work. We are in a bad place, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm just going to put that guy to sleep. Nobody spots him for a second, so I can sneak past. And there's a sleeping dog. And we're gonna keep that dog asleep by putting a tranquilizer dart in its butt. Or head. That works too. I wanna get to that truck. I've got an idea. It works. It works. The main wing hangar. Special delivery! I'm exactly where I need to be. Snake, I see you've managed to sneak into the hangar. Yeah, the Shag Odd's in here. 
The completed Phase II Shagahod represents a grave threat to the West. We can't allow it to be mass-produced. You've got to destroy it. Eva's got the data on the Shagahod. Do you think that's safe? Well, I wouldn't exactly say it's safe, but Khrushchev is a shrewd leader. I can't imagine he'd use it for anything other than deterrence. Volgin, however, is a different story. He's planning to use the Shagahod to turn the Cold War into a blazing hot one. We can't let him have it. Agreed. That leaves just one more mission for you to carry out. The boss. Exactly. Uh. For now, just focus on destroying the Shagahod. Yes, sir. I'll let Sigint fill you in on how to destroy it. Yo! Like Eva was saying, if you're looking to blow the whole place sky high, the best way is to take out those liquid fuel tanks with the C3. You know there's four tanks in there, right? You have to put C3 on all four of them. To plan a C3 charge, all you gotta do is equip the C3 and press the weapon button while standing in front of a tank. Just like TNT. But uh, make sure you don't plant it in the wrong place. You barely got enough C3 as it is, right? Good point. I'll make sure not to plant it anywhere else. Good, man. And be careful. Liquid fuel has a nasty habit of going off at the slightest shot. So don't go using any heavy firepower near the tanks unless you're aiming to get yourself barbecued. I'll keep that in mind. The C3 charges all have to go off at once if you want to bring down the hangar in one fell swoop. So if I were you, I'd wait until after you plant the last charge to start the timer mechanism. All right. I'll make sure I finish planting all four charges before I start the timer. Once the timer's set, you've got 20 minutes until it explodes, right? So make sure you get your ass out of that place by then. I think that's about all I've got. The rest is up to you. Good luck, pal. We're counting on you, Snake. You're counting on the wrong man. Right. I'm not sure if my scientist costume's gonna work in here. Probably not if they let all the scientists go. But I'm tempted to give it a try. Wait! Wait, 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 does this work? Can I just... Can I just walk around in here? Dressed up as Rykov? And not raise the alarm? Because that would be badass. And make everything massively easier also. Can I go here? Or is this locked off now? I'm curious now, actually. I've never tried this. I don't know. We'll see. I might be about to make a huge mistake here. But there's stuff here. A life med, suppressor. Okay, that's locked, okay. So the game kind of rewards you for getting curious about things at least. That's nice. I appreciate that. All right, all right, all right. One-handed mode, fuck you, man. That's not cool. Okay, they see through the disguise. That is... That is not good. I don't know why or how, but they see through it.
Okay. Ow. Ow. Okay, this is... Bye! Ow. How do I hide? Not like this. I don't think I can hide. Oh, Caden. Alright, this is not working out. This controller's fucked up too. The sticks get stuck. That ain't right. Officer uniform would work, but apparently not. So I don't know how to stealth it up here. I'm guessing the scientist uniform is not going to work either. You get to live at least. Um, you saw nothing. Checking my camo here. All the floors are green, so olive drab is the way to go. All right, cool. Greenish. Guess this gets us to the first fuel tank. Do we have them on the map? No.
Come with me and you'll be in a world of pain and torture. Pretty bad. Speak. All right, let's get our C4 out. C3. Aha, it's not so high tech. Speak. No, senor. No, habla. Yes, yes, you are. And I'm going with you. We ride to Valhalla. Yeah, nothing's changed in that regard. We can take turns using the pitchfork. Climbing to the top of the crane. Pitchford, what? Pitchford. What's, what's a Pitchford? Randy Pitchford. Yeah, sure. Snake? Eva. I finished planting the bomb on the rail bridge. If we get rid of the bridge, the enemy won't be able to follow us. That should at least buy us some time. I've also set up the escape route. How are things going on your end? I just finished planting the second charge. Give me a little more time. Okay. I'll be waiting for you at the bridge. Waiting for you at the bridge. Okay. How do I get to the top of the crane and what's the point of that? Now I'm curious. Because the game specifically gave me a hint that it's possible. There must be a purpose for it. But what? Who's that? Who the f saw me? Oh, him. Um, what? not how do I hide from these guys game they're supposed to let me do stealth how do I do stealth oh I can climb this up nice wait what's that I'm just gonna I'm gonna check on what you got up here in the rafters okay No, they can see me. I hide. No, my box. They'd be breaking my box. Oh shit, that's a grenade. This is a dead end. Help. The okay, only thing I can think of is just get out of this area or kill them all. Wait. Did we did we have Yep, we do. Ow! Ass.
Nene, nene, nene. Master of death. No, say, no, don't get stuck on that. See that? I got him in the arm. He dropped his gun because he was missing one hand. He wasn't able to use it. And then he used his other hand to pull out a pistol so he could still continue fighting one-handed. I really like that kind of detail in this game. Oh, come on. How many of Are you just going to keep spawning? Is that how this is going to go? Because I really don't want to do this. Yeah, this is not how you're... This is not how you're supposed to play this game, by the way. This is this is wrong. I'm playing badly. Are there actually still soldiers? Yes, there are. Hello, good sir. Would you like a hand grenade? Oh, there's another one. Sure thing. Good. Good bad. <laughs> I run away now. Goodbye. Oh, shit. No. Oh, it's a sleeping guard. Who can see me? Oh, that guy. Okay. Fuck off. Can I please plant my explosives now? Apparently not. have just exploded the building and restart from scratch. <gasps> Fuck. Well, that's annoying. That's annoying and that's completely on me. All right, fuck it. We're not going to do this pretty. We're just going to do it quick because now we get stuck here for any longer. So We're done being nice. Freeze. Where's he going? game. Good night. Well, I guess we're gonna have to do the fucking... 
Murder marathon. Oh, two for one. My sights are at dick level. Do not fuck with me. See? You do not want to come here. This is the kind of stuff that gets you labeled as a psychopath, by the way. Not good. All right, we're gonna go full on murder spree. Just clear this fucking place out. Excuse my language. No, you didn't. broke my leg. Yep. Split and bandage. We're good to go. I left a lot of dead bodies in here. Oh shit, I don't have the C3 equipped. Hold on. Backity pack. The D. Proceed. And rock and roll. Then, I want to check this out. I don't know if this is a thing. But I'm curious now, because I can go up here. I don't need a calorie make right now. But there's another ladder here, which I've never noticed before. Where does this get me? It gets me up onto the rafters, but is there anything here? Something. Handkerchief bullets. Sure. Oh, hey, buddy. How you doing down there? I'm just gonna poke you. A little dart. There we go. That one hit. So he should go to sleep soon. Good luck getting up here, asshole. Oh, they're sending in more guards now. One, two, three. Cool. Four. There's more stuff up here, though. Ah, uh, let's let's look around. I've never been up here before. One of that. It's something something really pointless.
Right, I'm gonna wait for a sec. Because those guards should leave. I think. So we're gonna we're gonna just cool off for a few moments. We might be here for a while. Oh, hello, cat. What you want? Good job. There's a cat requesting attention. Just a moment. Got our priorities straight here. For fantasy streamers, but sometimes you gotta pet the cat. Saw me and from where? I don't want to do this over again. How many fucking guys are there? Holy shit, is that annoying. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna save some time for next time. Because there's probably gonna be a next time. Hold on. We're gonna do the area transition. Oop. We're gonna come back. And it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It will be fine. We're just gonna take our stun pistol. We got 22 sleeping darts. We're just gonna put every mother fucking guy in here to sweet, sweet sleep. Right, so they don't... So, I need to learn that you can't arrest the mechanics. 
they're too scaredy, if you point a gun at them, they'll panic and run away. Rather, rather than do the sensible thing and put their hands up. It would be a good idea of me to remember that. Yeah. Fine. No! Unfucking believable. And now there's a guard coming. And the controls are jumpy as fuck. I missed. <laughs> no, I didn't miss. I kinda missed. Just not the way I thought. Wait, you're just gonna go back to work? A guy just passed out next to you and you're just gonna turn around and go, fuck it, I'll just push the switch a little. And there's another guard coming. Good night. Are there more? Hope not. Would really fucking hope not. This is also absolutely not how you're supposed to play this game, but I'm done giving a fuck. So I'm just gonna put darts every single motherfucking one of you. And you're all gonna pass out. And we're gonna watch. Thump. Thump. Oh, he didn't pat. Didn't I get him? Did I miss? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Just took him a while. Ha. Ah. And then... I think there's still a couple of guys here. And we're gonna sign to Sleepy Town. It's okay. We're a good spy. We don't kill people. We just put them to sleep. A chemically induced coma from which they may or may not ever awaken. Stop moving. Thank you. Boop. Now. C3. There's a guard. He gets a dose. Please don't let there be any more guards. I'm done with this fucking place now. Yes, we've had this conversation before. You, you're, you're ready to blow up the rail bridge. I know, lady. Thank you. Good job. Now go make me a sandwich. Bitch.
got you this time. <laughs> Tweak. Major, I finished planting the C3. I'm on my way out now. Hurry, Snake. Is Eva taking care of the escape route? Yeah. Are you sure? She can handle it. All right, then. We'll hurry up and get out of there. What question was that? Do we have an option of not trusting her? Snake! Oh, for fuck's sakes. That's a problem. I guess we can't trust her. Why'd you come back? I've just been reading a book about how these techniques are, like, designed originally. Interesting stuff. Much of it originates from Shanghai, apparently. minutes. Wait, was that the cutscene timer or the bomb timer? It might end the former. This woman was found snooping around my underground vault. When she was captured, look what we found on her. The philosopher's legacy. This microfilm contains all the information regarding the legacy. You might say that this film itself is the philosopher's legacy. It was the smell that gave her away. No, not the perfume. It was gasoline. Motorcycle gasoline. She reeked of it. To think that lovely Tatiana was a spy. We found this radio along with her too. Such a fine woman she was. It almost pains me to have to kill her. <laughs> yes, she was an obedient one. She was my precious little pet. Isn't that right? What was that? Do you have something to say to me? Go to hell! You dirty whore. I've had enough kisses from you straight in the ovaries I should have known Sokolov wasn't man enough to have a lover like that just like the KGB to send something so beautiful yet so deadly what is the philosopher's legacy very well I'll explain it before I kill you how nice of him. What a nice man. During the last great war, the most powerful men in America, China, and the Soviet Union had a secret pact. 
The pact was a blueprint for defeating the Axis powers and creating a new world order. To secure victory in the war, the three countries pooled their resources to conduct the most covert types of operations and research. The atomic bomb, rocket technology, the Cobra unit. And they amassed an enormous sum of money to fund these projects. Enough to fight the war five times over. That wealth is the philosopher's legacy. After the war was won, the three countries were to divide the philosopher's legacy amongst themselves. This explains why the United States and the Soviet Union were able to steal away the best scientific minds in Germany as soon as the war ended. But our great motherland has far surpassed its pathetic rivals. We possess enormous wealth, the most advanced technology, and overwhelming power, assets fitting of our great country. My father was one of the men in charge of managing the philosopher's legacy. In the confusion that ensued after the war ended, he devised a series of ingenious plots to ensure that the Soviet Union would have total control over the legacy. The money was divided up and laundered through banks all over the world. Switzerland, Australia, and Hong Kong. This microfilm contains a record of all those transactions. After my father's death, I learned of this secret and obtained the microfilm. With this money and the support of Brezhnev and his allies, I built this fortress of Groznygrad and Granin's research facility. But that worthless fool Granin failed to produce results. I was forced to turn to Khrushchev's dog Sokolov and his invention, the Shagohod. My position in Gru made it too troublesome to attack Sokolov's facility directly. But the spy network established by the secret pact still existed. I used it to contact the boss and suggested that she defect. The boss was conniving enough to see things my way. The world was once won, but the conflict between the philosophers has torn it in two. We will use the legacy to heal that rift and make the world whole again. To do this, we need strength, an unstoppable trump card with enough power to bring order to the world. That makes, it makes sense. The trump card was to be the Shago Hod and the Cobra Unit. I have lost the Cobras, but I still have the Shagohod and the Legacy. There is nothing America can do to stop us. Boss, take this someplace safe. Oh yeah, trust her with that. I'm sure that's gonna work out fine. Take good care of it. He wouldn't have come waltzing back in here unless he had a reason. The C-3's been stolen. He must be planning some sort of sabotage. I'll go see if there are any surprises waiting for us. I'll dispose of her as well. Yeah, she's completely trustworthy. Fight like a warrior, Volgan. But of course. Let me face him. I've been waiting for this moment. 
time to get even. Show off. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. No more judo and no more field strips. Come off. He's mine. You will stand right there and watch. Got it? Please, Colonel, let me. Silence! Longest cutscene in the game, and I love that they managed to look, go like, hey look, this is how long you have left. Let's get started, shall we? Make it a good one. Or is it for the actual timer? Ah! That was a perfectly good uniform you just ruined. Fair fight. Vulcan, you have fucked around. It's time to find out. go into my backpack and I'm going to change around some of the stuff. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Need that. And that. And that. So, how do you want to do this? Punchy, punchy. Ow. I don't think you get me punched. Ow. Okay. Punch him. What am I supposed to be doing? Ah, 
Okay, that doesn't work. Wait. What if I do this? Nope, not a lot. Right! Okay. Fuck. Okay, I cannot, for the life of me, have any idea what... Snake, watch out for Volgin's electric shock attacks. If you're shocked while equipping a gun, the bullets inside the magazine will ignite and the gun will explode. But he should be vulnerable just after launching a series of shock attacks. Avoid the attacks and either shoot him from his blind side or engage him directly with punches or CQC. And don't forget, for the timer is still ticking. Right. So bait his attacks. Try not to get punched. That's not damaging him. Okay. Oh, fuck. Cool. What the fuck am I doing? I'm gonna eat some noodles. Um... Wait. I'm gonna confuse him. I wonder if this does anything. Oh, he does react to it. Uh, help. What is he doing? is the point I don't think this was a good idea I think this might have been a terrible idea he's a he's a very angry man right now what the fuck can I just leave nope I haven't done any damage to him at all. That's a problem. What am I supposed to do? Okay, let's take off th this camel. This is not working. Let's fight like man, man to man. Come on, Vulcan. Give me a break. I don't know how to damage him. I do not know how to damage him. Like, he just shrugs off any punches I throw, no matter the direction. Suggestions? Vulcan seems to be deflecting bullets away by wrapping a powerful electromagnetic field around his body. You won't hit him if you fire at him from the front. If you're going to attack him with a gun, do it from the side or the back. Thanks. Let's see your 
Oh, okay. What are you doing, Snake? The auto aim doesn't kick in at all. Cool. Nope. Nope. Fuck it. Okay. Holy shit, we hit him. Okay. Just shooting from, shooting from the back. That works. Okay, this this just became easier. I figured out the pattern. Nice. Okay. That was easy. Yeah, if you be, if you bring a shotgun to a fist fight. It should be a lot easier. Shoot him! Do you hear me? I said shoot him! Sorry, Colonel. I'm afraid I can't do that. What do you mean you can't? I made a promise to the boss. Silence! I am your commanding officer. My authority. Fight like a man, Volgin. Volgin. Ocelot, find those bombs! Move it! For some more snake. Yeah, sure, why not? I can run circles around you and shoot you in the back with a shotgun. I'd rather not, though. Jesus. Ow. Bullshit! Got me in the leg. Whoa! Fuck! One or two more shots, come on. Oh, come on. No. We have one life met, and I'm going to fucking use it. You are not going to fuck you. <laughs> All right. Oof. For a moment, I thought I was fucking dead.
you later right now we've got to get to the lake and escape we can't leave yet i've still got one last job to do the boss is already at the lake huh she's at the lake she's waiting for you there waiting for me i was hoping i wouldn't have to tell you I don't want you to fight her. But I... I've come to realize that there's a special relationship between you two. Something I can't understand. Something that goes beyond a man and a woman. I envy you. Really, I do. But I guess I just can't understand it. She asked me to tell you something. I've never seen someone with such clear eyes. There. I said it. Ready to go? Yeah. Yeah. We might be in for some primary problems now.